he's one of the greats. He's like, he's the kind of people you aspire to work with. And, and I couldn't believe I was lucky enough to get in the room with him, let alone get a job with him. So, um, and I wanted the challenge of working with someone who's, who's that tough. And his reputation is, uh, is interesting and, and daunting. And I kind of wanted to see if I could handle it. Well, he expects you to be prepared and he expects you to know what you're doing. And, to, and, and uh, you know, I was one of the only women in the film, but he doesn't, he never treated me like a girl. I was one of the boys and he, uh, so there was no special treatment. He's brutally honest. And I think that's why people think he comes across as tough. But he's just, he knows what's truthful and he knows when you're being false and he can identify it and he just tells you. Whereas some, you get directors who, who tell you you're being brilliant when you're not and you know you're not and it doesn't help anyone. Whereas Oliver just tells you what's going on and then gives you some insight or some uh, backstory and then you're back in the scene. He, he'll refocus as you bring it. So I feel like probably a bit stronger than I was. I, I think I went in with all guns blazing so I was determined not to be sort of a weak link. So I think I, um, I went in being really tough with him. Because I thought, well, if I'm weak and I go in and he's tough, then he'll, be, he'll just dig at me. If I go in being like, then then he won't have that opportunity. So I think probably I'm a bit stronger.